आई प्रेजेंट टू यू इंडिया की सबसे ज्यादा भयानक R5 Ryzen R5 entry ever have a look at the octa core Ryzen R5 1600 रिजल्ट आने वाला है तो अगर अभी तक तुमने मुझे इंस्टाग्राम फॉलो नहीं किया है स्क्रीन जॉनी सेव जॉर्ज इंस्टाग्राम पे फॉलो करने के लिए इसलिए बोल रहा हूँ बिकॉज वहां पर जो है हम पहले इंस्टाग्राम पे अपने विनर्स को अनाउंस कर देंगे बाद में उसके ऊपर बनेगा वीडियो और बाद में वीडियो आएगा तो अगर तुमको पहले जाना है कौन जीता है इंस्टाग्राम बॉय ऑल्सो बिना टाइम वेस्ट करते हुए चलते हैं अभी हाल देखने के लिए क्या क्या एंट्रीज आई हैं आज की वीडियो के लिए बहुत ज्यादा मौत एंट्रीज आई है गाइज बिलीव मी विदाउट एम वेस्टिंग टाइम विदाउट वेस्टिंग एनी टाइम लेस बिगिन दीडियो राइट ना I'm crazy. <laughs> okay, let's begin the video by having a look at the very first entry. जो पहली एंट्री मैंने पिक की है वो है एक लैपटॉप एंट्री दिस इज फ्रॉम अ गाय नोन एज वॉट्सल जैन थैंक यू वॉट्सल फॉर एंट्रिंग इन दट ऑफ वॉस And now let's have a look at the specifications of the laptop. It is having an Intel Core i7 7700HQ, which is a KB Lake quad core 8 thread, i.e., yani hyper thread wala CPU. Hai. Also, this laptop is a proper gaming laptop because it is having a GTX 1050 4GB variant. Ha, 1050 Ti ke alawa 1050 ke andar bhi 4GB ka variant aata hai. This laptop is also having 16GB of RAM, and thanks to that 7700HQ, the Cinebench score is around 740CB, which is, according to today's score, also significantly a very high performance score. Hai. Moving on to his peripherals, he's using a JBL Go Bluetooth speaker, also using a mechanical keyboard, which is the Cosmic Byte GK03, which is a review on my channel. Pe already done it. And a Red Gear wireless controller. Additionally, he's also having an MSI mousepad and a standard mouse. Okay, now because this is a laptop entry, that is why we will not be going into the keyboard management area. And let us now move on to the next entry right now. What are you kidding me? I have like read about it. मैंने इस बारे में पढ़ा है, लेकिन I could have never imagined in my life कि मैं इस PC को setup box के अंदर देखूँगा. I present to you India की सबसे ज़्यादा भयानक R5 Ryzen R5 entry ever. Have a look at the octa core Ryzen R5 1600. Eight core solar thread Ryzen R5 1600 on your screen right now. Boom! तो जिन लोगों को इसके बारे में नहीं मालूम है कि R5 के अंदर ऑक्टा कोर कैसे आया पहले उनको मैं देता हूँ बैक स्टोरी असल में हुआ ये था अराउंड थ्री मंथ्स बैक AMD के पास R5 का जो है वो स्टॉक खत्म हो गया था लेकिन AMD डी वॉन्टेड टू कम्पीट राइट तो उन्होंने R5 के अंदर ही R7 डाल दिया 1600X के अंदर डाल दिया एटीन हंड्रेड और सिक्सटीन हंड्रेड के अंदर डाल दिया सेवनटीन हंड्रेड एक्स और उन्होंने आर फाइव के अंदर आर सेवन डाल दिया उसको पैक करा और शिप कर दिया ये सिंगल लॉट निकला था उसके बाद इनके पास जो है स्टॉक ऑफिस आ गए थे लेकिन ये सिंगल लॉट कहाँ कहाँ गया पीपल डोंट नो अबाउट दिस थिंग अमेरिका में ये गया था बिकॉज फॉरन के लोगों ने अपलोड किया था कि हमारे पास आर के अंदर ऑक्टा कोर मिल गया दे वर सुपर हैप्पी अबाउट दिस थिंग इंडिया के अंदर ऐसी कोई भी चीज देखी नहीं गई थी अनटिल टूडे सो लेट्स गेट बैक टू दीडियो मूविंग ऑन टू पीसी स्पेक्स ही गॉट राइज एन आर फाइव सेवनटीन हंड्रेड एक्स जान बुझे मैंने वो चीज बोली ही सिंगल stick of 8GB Corsair Vengeance RAM clocked at 3000 MHz and the graphics card is GTX 1060 3GB variant from Zotac the mini version a 250GB Samsung solid state drive a 1TB Western Digital Blue Caviar all inside a white 
themed Chiptronics cabinet. The overall setup definitely looks cool to me, but there are always a few things which can be improvised. Like the cables under your table can be tied up and what not can be done. You can apply some LED strips behind your monitor. That would look cool. Talking about his peripherals, he has also got a PlayStation 4. That looks like a pro to me, but I'm not pretty sure because I'm not a PlayStation player. And a Game DS mechanical keyboard with a Logitech G402, which is my personal favorite mouse because I've been using it since like a long time. Finally, moving on to the next setup. This next entry is done by Suraj aka Kelvin Mercer. He really has a great gaming and editing setup. It's an Intel i5-7500 paired with a GTX 1066 GB from Gigabyte. 8 gigs of RAM, all inside the Circle CC830 cabinet. His primary monitor is from Dell, a 21.5 inch Full HD IPS monitor. Secondary display is the 19.5 inch BenQ monitor. The audio setup is 2.1 speakers from Intex, which is having a Dragon Ball Z action figure on top of it. Headphones are each G2000 from Koshin. The keyboard is the Ola Wings of Liberty RGB mechanical keyboard, a Dragon Ball G12 gaming mouse with its gaming mouse mat. Okay, welcome back. This setup was definitely doing hell lot of crazy banane here. Also, if we talk about Suraj's PC, then dude, he's doing a lot of PC. Definitely hell of a performance in this PC. I would say that as soon as prices drop on the RAM, get yourself an 8GB RAM because uh, your PC do require 8GB RAM more. Also, if you want to experiment, kar sakte ho, you can definitely apply some RGB strips or a blue color ki strip behind your table. You know That would definitely make uh, the setup look overall better. एक नंबर लगेगा, looks good. Also तुम्हारा जो कैबिनेट है, white color का है, blue रंग की थीम के साथ है, that that will definitely match with your theme also. Yeah. Moving on to the next setup, we have got this budget PC build, which is having a G forty F sixty. Does not have any graphics card. Have a look at this dual core quad thread CPU, जिसका सेवेन स्कोर आता है. तीन सौ छप्पन. The motherboard is H one ten. The overall RAM is four GB. The cabinet is from Zebronix. He has a liquid crystal display with a LCD HCL monitor, gaming keyboard and mouse combo from Red Gear. He's also having a Red Gear wired gaming controller and FND 2.1 speakers. I have really not seen any good cable management, but then surely Vampy has done some good job right here. Okay, so the next entry is going to be the last entry of the episode number two of Set of Wars. If you have entry ko dusre creators ne upload nahi kiya hai aur maine bhi upload nahi kiya hai, to bhi do not worry. If you entry properly humne receive kari hai, so humne video bheje hai, yani ke set up ka video humne bheja hai, humko cinema score bheja hai, humko photos bheje hai, definitely humko ek contender ke taur pe liya jayega. Also, Instagram pe pehle hi uske winners ko announce kar diya jayega. Moving on to the next entry, this is going to be वन ऑफ अ मीडियोकर एंट्री यहां पर है इंटेल कोर i3 8100 एट जनरेशन का क्वाड कोर क्वाड थ्रेड वाला सीपीयू जो कि बहुत ही सही प्राइस टू परफॉर्मेंस रेशियो वाला सीपीयू है पेयर्ड विद अ GTX 1050 Ti एंड अ 8GB की रैम व्हिच इज क्लॉक्ड एट 3000 मेगाहर्ट्ज वाओ दैट इज समथिंग गुड दिस एंट्री हैज बीन सेंट टू अस बाय मिस्टर आशीष अकॉर्डिंग टू हिम इट इज गोइंग टू बी हिज ओनली एडिटिंग पीसी आई विल बी सेइंग इट डेफिनेटली अगर तुम्हारे पास 8GB की रैम है 3000 मेगाहर्ट्ज पे क्लॉक्ड है 1050 Ti है 8100 है क्वाड कोर है 3.6 गीगाहर्ट्ज पे Definitely editing will be without any difficulty, for sure. Moving on to his setup, we can clearly see that he has spent every single cash on his computer. The lab care mouse is extremely cheap. The Zebronics keyboard is also cheap. Even the monitor seems cheap to me. As per his sentiment score goes, they are right in front of your screen. On the other hand, he is also having a professional audio interface which is the Focusrite Scarlett paired with the Audio-Technica professional headphones. His audio setup is the FND 2.1 speakers and his cabinet is from Cooler Master. But I would seriously say this one thing that this is the best budget system that one could build right now. With that said guys, I would like to end the video right now. If you have taken part in the setup boss giveaway, I would like to give you a really very good wala thumbs up. Hope ki tum hi jito. Also, abhi is video yahin pe khatam karte hain. Like, share, subscribe, teen chiza karni hoti hain. Apne hisaf se ho kuch kar do. Agar like kar rahe ho, to aaj ki video ka hum dalte hain aim. 350 likes if that is possible just do that if not possible Moving on, Instagram पर भी आ जाऊँ because वहाँ पर भी मैं उल्टी सीधी stories डालता रहता हूँ so I'm gonna meet you right there on Instagram till then goodbye take care and everyone peace out